4, 3, 2, 1 Hi there, this is Cindy and this third video will be about my travelling makeup bag which I had brought to Spain, Malaga the past few weeks I'm not taking any luggage with me that's why I have to restrain myself from bringing too many makeups with me and making sure that all of them could fit into the small plastic bag that we had to put inside mm. and making sure that they are not over 100 ml so I'll get started with the face products that I have brought the first one I'm going to show you is this one the BB cream and the BB cream is really popular in Asian countries and it's like it can do it all it's a concealer on its own. It's good enough to cover your dark eye circles, your spots, your wrinkles, and your pores. It has sunscreen SPF in it. In this case, this is 42 PA++. It acts as a moisturizer on its own too, and it gives really good coverage. You don't need to bring an extra concealer. It's easy to bring, easy to use, and you practically just use it with your bare hands and fingers. So. I would definitely recommend this and it's under a hundred ml so it's good for traveling and the next product that I'm going to show you is this Maybelline pure powder to set my makeup I brought this and next one is the elf highlighter concealer although I did say that when you use the BB cream you don't really need any concealer but I still bring this anyway um, to use this highlighter and the concealing part and proceeding to the next one would be my eyes product I didn't bring individual eyeshadows that's why I brought this ELF palette with me which is kinda cool because you had all the colors you need inside I'm gonna open this up and I'm gonna close up the mirror which is so big yep a big ass mirror anyway here we go this is the lipstick part as you can see there are many colors of lipsticks here's the eyeshadow you get green you get gold you get white um, brown and you even get the gray sorry the gray is here and this is the blusher Oh sorry, and this is the bronzer and this is the eyebrow kit. I don't really use the eyeliner because it's too hard for me. But all in all, this is a very fabulous kit. You get all the colors here. It's very shiny and it's pigmented. I use it for day and night and it works really well for me. The next eye product I'm going to show you is this um MAC white in color eyeliner is white the next one would be the black coal eyeliner from L'Oreal this is so fabulous I can do a review just on this it's so pigmented it just stays there it doesn't smudge this out on me so I practically keep using this and it's quite um, a good sum there because have you been using it for about two years and a half and it's still here although I do know that I need to change it due to uh, cleanliness wise but nonetheless a very fabulous eyeliner the next one is mascaras I brought two mascaras and I don't know why uh, my preference would be this the L'Oreal telescopic mascara it really gives my eyelashes very good coverage it just fans out my eyelashes it doesn't clump out it just makes my eyes look wide open and this is my favorite of all the mascaras that I have used although I don't use too much but this is the number one in my list the second mascara that I brought is the Rimmel Sexy Curves although it do separate my eyelashes really well but I just hope that it could have more of a pigmentation I hope that it could um, really get to my eyelashes but it didn't so I just bring it just in case my L'Oreal drop or something <laughs> so okay 
enough of the eye stuff I'm going to talk about my lip stuff and I think I'm going really crazy about makeup I actually brought um, five products this is the one that I use most although it dries up on me really fast but I still like the color it's not too pigmented it's from Ianti lip gloss and it's a Korean brand here we go it, I've had this for about two and a half years still here still working really well and I like this the next two is a free gift I've got this is the Lancome um, Juicy Tubes and this is the Gemma Kid um, although I do get this free but I do think this Lancome works better much better well than this one I'm not sure why maybe it's my preference um, but I do think that this smells really nice this is okay it smells okay but it's a bit sticky for me but this one just lasts really long it's not that sticky and I like the wee bit of pigmentation it has so another two lip glosses the next one is the Barry M's that I've brought uh, the first one is the palest lavender I like it very much when I want to pale out nude out my lips not completely nude out but um, to make sure that the focus will be on my eyes so I just use this it's the color in 129 the next one would be the 140 I don't remember what's the name of this I have to check it out and I'll list it in my sidebar and this one is very good in pigmentation both of Barry M's lipstick are very moisturizing it glides on really well on my lips it doesn't crack on me although I sometimes I do prefer to have lip glosses over it to make it look more moisturizing but all in all Barry M has very good lipsticks and I decided to buy more and invest more in them okay the last part of this um, uh, thing is <clears throat> my accessories as you know all girls good companion would be eyelash color I got this from Elf and it's only 150 and I bought four brushes with me I didn't bring too many brushes I want to save our space so the first one is the Elf complexion brush Oops. the Elf complexion brush is so good it's good for everything face wise such as brush uh, blush sorry the bronzing the face powder I just use practically this one to buff out everything and then I brought three of the eyes um, brushes first is this elf studio line oopsie elf studio line C brush very good on packing colors and this is the elf and the elf both are normal line and this is the shadow brush this is the Sorry, this is the blending brush. Both brushes are really soft, although they're only 150 pounds, but they do really well. The blending brush is so soft, it just blends out all my makeup. And this one is just very good in picking up colors, uh, spreading them out evenly. It doesn't shred, which is very good. So, this is it. This is my um, makeup traveling things that I brought. It's not too much, that's why, um, but I do hope that you enjoy this video.